Hi, I'm Jennifer. Welcome to our I Create Art tutorials. Today we are going to go over chalk pastel. So as you can see here, I have a drawing started and I have a little reference image that's going to help me choose my colors. And I, of course, have my chalk pastels. And I have a whole bunch of different colors and the first thing I'm going to do is look for the colors that I see in this pair. And you might say, the pair is green. And that is true, the pear is green, but there's also some yellow and some white and some orange in here also, maybe even a little bit of brown. So we are going to layer our chalk pastel colors so that we can have a lot of variation in here. And to use a chalk pastel, basically just want to lay it down on its side and gently rub to apply color to your paper. So I'm going to put my yellow over here on this side. I'm not going to worry too much about my edges here. Normally when you're completing a whole picture, you do want to put your background in first so that if you go outside your lines a little bit, it's easier to touch it up. And then I'm going to put in a little bit of orange and I'm going to press really lightly with this. I don't want my orange to overpower. If you're going in a small area, you can use kind of this edge here. But you don't really ever want to use the corner unless you're drawing um, like a really specific detail, like maybe the the line in that leaf there. Uh, you might you might use that corner. And that's just because we're going to blend our chalk pastel and that harsh line is just a little bit harder to soften. You can see I still have some of my paper showing through here. That is, that is just fine. You can layer and layer and layer and you can get that kind of filled in, taken care of um, a little bit later. So look, I'm just putting areas of color onto my paper. Okay, I have a little bit of dust here. I'm going to take that dust and I'm going to put that into a garbage can. Okay? I'm not going to blow it into the air or anything like that. I don't want it on the carpet. I'm going to dispose of that. I'm going to take one finger. And I'm just going to rub and start to cover up all of that paper. Look at how those gaps are getting all filled in now. I'm going to blend my areas together, but I'm not going to go all the way across. I don't want my yellow necessarily all the way over there right now. I can follow the shape of the pear as I'm blending. It's nice and rounded. And then I have a base layer for my pear. And I can go back in and add more color on top. I can blend or not blend once I have my base layer down. So if I don't blend, you can see I almost get some of that natural pear texture in here. All right, so I'm going to leave that as it is. I want a nice bright highlight on here. All right, I want that nice light green in there, curve a little bit, and go in the shape of that pear, and just soften. I don't have to even blend all the way. I can just kind of tap with my finger to soften a little bit. And then if I want something really specific, like these little dots, I can go in and that's when I'm going to maybe use that corner. Just get those little dots in there. Okay. 
And you can see that. Now I have that pear texture. If I ever feel like I need to clean up an edge anywhere, I have this nice kneaded eraser and I can form this into a little point and I can just kind of tap the areas that I want to clean up. And if my eraser gets dirty, I'm just going to stretch it and squish it. And then I can go right back to erasing. Right. So that's just a quick guide of how to use some of your chalk pastels. If you enjoyed this video and you would like to watch other tutorials from us, please be sure to click on the subscribe button. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.